streaming on Facebook, Shaviva. And you know, every Friday at a certain particular time, we've got to say what? Boom, shaka laka. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Yes, indeed. And we're going to Zoom shakalaka anyway, uh, right. even though we are sheltered in place, Shaviva. Yep, yep. Sheltering in place is uh, the thing to do these days because it's rough out here, but we're going to have a good time anyway. Yeah. Yes, well, and look who's here. Carry look on. Look who's here. We got Mayor Quentin Hart. Welcome to the show today, and thank you. Thank you. Thank you for having me. Glad to be back, actually. <laughs> oh, yes. We were talking. We noticed that beard you're growing. You kind right. of just sheltered in place and you, you talked about not being able to see your barber regularly. So. For real. Um, I got to start doing YouTube videos on how to cut your own hair. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I think everyone can identify. And here we are back to square one again, you know, with this whole thing, kind of like it was back in March and April, Mayor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's uh, probably um, probably doubled or tripled uh, from that particular time. So, yeah, we are we are uh, heavy in this uh, fight and this battle right now. So we just may absolutely need to make sure that uh, people continue to remain safe. Um, the holidays are coming up as well. And I know it's hard telling people uh, don't go by and get some of that, uh, that sweet potato pie and all those things. But we absolutely have to watch, watch what we do because this situation is something that we give to other people. Uh, so we definitely want to make sure that we're uh, uh, safe, we're masked up, and all of that stuff. Right. And Shaviva, how about you? How are you celebrating the holidays this year? Well, you know, I'm not a real big uh, holiday person from jump. But the all things considered, as far as what the situation is, you know, it's always wonderful to see your loved ones, but you want to be able to see them in the future. You know, so it's... <laughs> It's a small a sacrifice as far as I'm concerned to just sort of lay back, relax, and do a whole lot of nothing. Exactly. Are you getting together uh, with your family, extended family mayor? Uh, no, just my household. Uh, just my household uh, right now. Um, like I said, it, it's, it, I can't, I've never even imagined that it would it would be not a good practice to be around family, right? Uh, really? I, can't even, I can't even believe that I even fixed my mouth to even say something like that. But, um, you know, right now, you know, 2020, I've seen so many pictures and when people say 2020 is a, um, <laughs> you know. <laughs> Fill in the blank. Yeah, for real. But um, right. yeah, I hope folks stay safe, uh, uh, safe at home. Yes. Well, we want to um, make sure that people do stay safe. And we also want to make sure that everyone hears this question. Did you get it shared, Shaviva, on the wall that we were trying to share? Nope. Sorry. Okay. All right. Go ahead. Okay. But we want to talk to you about Mar Margo's Waterloo Proud History Moment. And we got a question, Mayor, for you. I bet you you know. Shaviva, can you read the question? Yes, absolutely. What African-American woman from Waterloo was born the daughter of sharecroppers, but published a book about her journey from being on welfare to a university professor? The first person that gives that answer online uh, wins a boom shakalaka cup. Yes, a coffee cup. Yes. Made by made by good things by precious. Yes. Wow, okay. Yes. So yeah, she's the pioneer. Can you you are you thinking about who it is, Mayor? We had her picture on the same post with yours. <laughs> I, I don't want to answer the question for people. So this is something right. we're we're the we're the teachers right now. So I don't want to answer for people. So I, I know the answer, but okay. I'm not going to give it away. All right. Well, that's perfectly fine. All right. We had a great show last week, Shaviva. 
Yes, yes, we absolutely did. Um, it was nice to have Brian Sink visit us. We hadn't kicked it with him for a while, so that was kind of fun. And it was a, a special treat for him to bring out his guitar and play happy birthday to the folks at the end of the show. Exactly. And this week we've got Amber Collins and Mayor, we've seen pictures of you there in the bookstore. Uh, actually, I went there and visited her just a couple of uh, days ago and um, just so excited about that new store. Talk about that. Man, you know, knowledge is power, right? And when you're talking about getting that knowledge and having that power, uh, you have to visit uh, the store. So many incredible books. You know, I'm still a little bit of old school. I don't do everything on the iPad, but a lot of the books and information is completely incredible. And it is so refreshing to see another black business in downtown Waterloo. So you have to get out and support uh, Amber by as much as you can uh, when you go in there. And don't be asking for a discount either. Uh, no. No, <laughs> for real. neither one of y'all asked for a discount. Go in there right. and buy it like we do when we go anywhere else. But yes. shout out to Amber. Yes, exactly. She Hopefully she'll be joining us, but we also hope that her business is going so well that she's so busy she can't join right. us. So whatever way the uh, the tide turns, we'll just roll with it. But well, you, yeah, can, you, know, so, you can socially distance and be in there at the same time as well. So that may be a location. It's so big, right? Exactly. Yeah. And I think we're going to be doing a book signing there too. And she's going to share us, share with us some good things going on there today when she joins us. Mm -hmm. But yeah, how you doing, Shaviva? I'm not. I'm, I'm, you know what? Next time you need something like this done, I think you're going to have to do it yourself. Because all I'm okay. doing is. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, we did have can a I say, Can I say something else, too, real quick? Yeah. I know it's off script. It's been a while. But um, I just want to say to the both of you, you know, a little bit earlier but before we started, uh, we were talking about partnerships from a long time ago. And, <laughs> we were at Archive, and when we did the African-American read-in, uh, you know, you, you guys were authors. You were reading to students. You were telling them of the importance of literacy, the importance of reading. So, you know, to have the conversation, to, to being back then and all the work you both have done and into talking about Amber's store, this is, this is like an incredible literacy um, um, conversation. So I just want to give a shout out to you guys and partnerships. Y'all may not remember me then. I may have had a jerry curl back then. <laughs> Oh, we remember you. <laughs> oh, we remember you. This a minute. And you know, uh, Mayor Hart, you you were right at home back then because the memory I have of it, of you is standing at a podium, actually, you know, instructing, you know, the whole thing. And thank you so much for that compliment. It certainly means a lot. Um, and we do enjoy working together, and are so excited um, that. You know, we've come this far. And like you said, we've got decades. <laughs> decades in this thing. We've been doing this since before it was popular. Since uh -huh. it was popular to do this. Huh? <laughs> right, right. And we want to talk about RLCA. Now, you know all about that. I think I tagged you in our, in our fundraiser that's on our wall, Mayor Hart. You may not have seen it yet. But Royal Legacy Christian Academy is having high five Fridays. Every Friday, we can give the students a high five by donating $5 or more in support of the school. And it's great. And it's great programs such as Spanish Immersion and send donations to rlcawaterloo.org backslash support. And that's PayPal. They have PayPal and Cash App. So. Yeah, so everybody needs to uh, donate to Royal Legacy and try to do it on a regular basis because those needs are real and they're still going. So we're thankful for that. I'm glad to say I am a proud supporter of Royal Legacy. So absolutely. Yes. And you dodged the bucket. You had the uh, police chief get doused. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, back in the summertime with that ice water. Yeah. Right. Yeah. 
<laughs> yeah, you know, I just, you know, my shoulder, I was in a swing, right? So, I mean. Okay, that's right. That's right. I didn't yeah, want to get the swing wet. <laughs> <laughs> you can't do everything all at once. What about that North End Art Fest, the virtual part, Shaviva? Yes, absolutely. Uh, seeing as how we weren't able to do uh, an actual live fest like last year and the years before, the North End Arts and Music Fest has been doing a uh, digital performance series. And uh, so far, um, we've enjoyed Ames and Kanisha Davis. And I'm sure there are going to be more people coming up too. And these are 20, 25 minute sets that come on, they, they debut on Friday. So be on the lookout for that. Good music. Yes. yes. And Mayor, what were, were you a part? What is that that you guys are doing over there at the Marriott, you young people? Um, it was, I don't know if you know, uh, everybody knows Joy Briscoe. So I yes. almost said Joy Silas, Joy Briscoe, but um, she does her uh, Cedar Valley Expo every year. And it's the, the most, the, the finest talent, styling, uh, creativity, artistry, uh, one of the biggest events of the entire year, I'll say the biggest. And you remember when we used to have the Essence Festival back in the day here? Yeah, uh, it is. Uh, yeah. Well, I'm sorry, but this is the Essence, Essence Festival on steroids because you have oh. local talent, local um, uh, models, clothing designers, so, and they did it virtual this year in partnership with the University of Northern Iowa, uh, scenes at the Marriott and artists. It was, oh my gosh, I wish yeah. I had some talent. If I oh. had some talent, I'd be, I'd be <laughs> something. And that, and it would, that is the showcase of the entire community. So she did a uh -huh. tremendous job, her and everybody that helped support. Right. So when will we be able to, is it the 27th? Is that the date that I saw for its release? I believe so. I believe so. Oh, okay. And we've okay. been seeing little snippets, little teases online, and it does look like it's going to be fabulous. So yeah. I'm looking yes. forward to that. Yeah. Yes, indeed. All right. Yeah, we got Mayor Hart sitting there. Let's just go ahead and have a party. Let me pour myself a little brandy. No, we can. Uh, I mean, we we good. We can all uh, toast to um, uh, intelligence, beauty, <laughs> intelligence, beauty, friendship, and uh, black excellence. And then we can call it an evening. Fine, I love the way you call the shots. All right, <laughs> All right. well. We uh, Shaviva, Shaviva didn't, didn't, okay. We gotta, we gotta be in the same picture, same time. Yeah. All right, here's a toast. I'll see here's you later. For staying safe. All right. See All you guys right. later. See you next time. See you next time.